Hey everybody, I'm Tony Fleming from Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Today we're going to look at what I think is probably an over-restored pickup. You say, Tony, how's it possibly an over-restored pickup? Well, when you make it so much nicer than it was from the factory, uh, that's how it becomes overstored. And you say, well, who would do such a thing? And I'd say, you know what? I would definitely do such a thing because who wouldn't want a truck that's a little better than it was when it was new? Perfect. The owner of this truck owns his own shop. Nice family. I met them. This right here was their personal vehicle. It only has a few hundred miles on it. They took it to some shows and things like that. They were paring down their collection because they're just getting, uh, I think it was just too much for them to handle. So now it's being offered for the first time to the public after being all done. We're going to take a minute. We're going to look at all of the little detail stuff that you would have done yourself if you own this pickup. And why do I say that? Because this is the way to buy one. This costs way more than uh, what it's being sold for. And people understand that when they restore a vehicle, a lot of times they do it for therapy and things like that. In this case here, this is a beautifully restored truck. All right. So listen, this is Azure turquoise, man. This is a cool color. God, look at this thing. You know what? Here's the problem too. In this showroom, it's amongst a lot of other supermodels and all the cars in here look really great. However, this truck out on the road, everybody goes crazy over it. That's thumbs up and this because we all remember riding one of these with our grandfather or our dad. Uh, maybe one of a friend had one of these or you went to a field party and what have you in something like this. And this is a cool truck. The color is great. You know why the color is great? Because you can't paint a modern car today this color and get away with it. You can paint it silver. You can paint them red. You can paint them black. But this color right here is very period correct and very period specific. One of the things that makes it stand out so much. But most importantly, we need to look at the quality of the paint and it's painted underneath. It's painted in the bed. It's painted all over in the jams. And I want to show you when you look at this stuff here, the video will show you the quality of paint. Make sure you can read all the letters nice and crisp, not see the letters, but read the letters and go there. And then you'll know what kind of paint we're talking about. I want to show you where a lot of money is spent. Forget the fact that the body on the car is beautiful, the paint is great and what have you. The drivetrain is just equally as important. And let's look under here for a second. This is awesome. This is uh, LS power, right? With the FI Tech EFI upgrade, intake manifold over here, standalone computer system here, vintage air conditioning with a polished compressor. You say, well, Tony's got air conditioning. What's it matter about a polished compressor? Well, it doesn't matter, but the fact is it's that little extra dollars that somebody spent because it was their truck. They didn't do this to flip it. They did it to drive it and own it. And that's the kind of vehicle you want to buy. So if you went to a truck show or a car show or whatever, you wanted to open the hood and you wanted to see the detail in here is great. The wiring in here is brand new. The braking system in here is brand new. The core support is brand new. The radiator is brand new. The condenser is brand new. It's on and on. The grill, the lights and all that stuff. There is so much tied up in it. It's essentially like a brand new 69. All right, so the back of here, we're going on about new, 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 new taillight bezels, new lenses, new bumpers, new bumper bolts, the tag light even works. You say, tell them the tag light works. Isn't it supposed to? Yes, it's supposed to. But 99% of the vehicles we get here, the tag light never works. The reverse lights don't work either, okay? This is what I'm talking about. When somebody goes to the effort to make sure all this stuff works, you know that the detail is done. Here's another big detail. The bed, rhino lined, okay, in the color of the truck. The bed is tinted, right, in that color. And then you say, well, Tone, how did tailgating start? How you doing? Come on over and let's tailgate a little bit. All right, so come join me in here because we're going to continue on with the theme of new, new, new. So polished steering column, right? I did it steering column. It's kind of nice because whoever drives it might like the wheel wherever they like it. All custom dash and teletronics showing 305 miles. But more importantly, it's got 160 mile an hour speedometer. I'm not sure you're going to drive it at 160, but who cares? Anyway, 8,000 RPM tack, temp gauge, oil gauge, fuel gauge, volts, digital sound system, the AC and heat system. It's a modern heat and AC system. So you're not just getting modern air conditioning. You're also getting modern heat as well, which is under the dash here. We have an emblem for the glove box coming. Um, I'm not really sure what happened to it, but somehow it disappeared and those things happened. But anyway, painted in the cab, new visors, new seat covers, new carpets, on and on and on. And if you want to individualize it yourself a little bit, you could choose your own steering wheel. If you don't love this style of steering wheel, you could add uh, a different style yourself. We can install it for you here. Or you can put it on yourself. But all the stuff is new, like the door panels and the window cranks and the regulators inside. And these right here, if you decide to take up smoking because it's cool, right? Uh, these all work like they're supposed to. And how you doing? Anyway, back in the day, we might have done that. Today, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Anyway, 
Awesome, awesome interior. And this is a big enough interior too to put seating in here for four. Can you imagine going with the kids or another couple or something out to dinner, to a party or a car show or whatever? It's a whole new experience. All right, so we close up the video on this. All of the hard work has been done. Body and paint, drivetrain with overdrive automatic so you can drive on the highway to the beach or whatever. New chrome, stainless, the bed, the underneath of the truck is beautiful. The gas tank's been moved from the back of the seat to back there underneath the bed, which I really like. That's a great idea, right? LS power, fuel injected, air conditioned, overdrive, upgraded dash, digital sound system. I mean, it goes on and on and on. And you know what? If you wanted to change the wheels and tires and make them your own or maybe do a couple small touches inside, maybe some cool floor mats with this color binding on them, right? Those are the little touches that you want to do. You want to tinker, but you don't want to have to build a truck. And this is why you want to get this one. It's already built and ready to go. Anyway, call us 301-816-1000. We'll tell you all about this great 69 Pro Touring pickup. And don't forget to uh, like the video if you would, please, and subscribe to the channel below and share this with your friends.